Welcome to IFC, so we have a first look at the new Lid um, Lydia menu and so much more classic skins and more. But do like, subscribe with the bell notification, follow me to the future for more content. So yes, we have some stuff that we have to show right now as Lydia has officially unlocked. I know a lot of us were thinking when and you can see right now that she's officially unlocked. So if you restart your game now, it should boot up and switch the game off, restart it. And then it should start up and unlock with everything because she's officially out now for early access for those of you who have this then we also have the menu this is how it will look when you reboot it back up so eddie is gone eddie's long gone and now lydia is officially in control it doesn't just stop there the stuff that you'll be seeing as we have some new star eyes as well for customizations they look pretty good i would put that on jun kazama to be fair i don't know why we would suit her then we also have the android eyes i think this looks really cool i would actually really put these on these are some really cool accessories to put on for your customizable characters and whatnot then we also have king he will also be coming along as one of the arcade avatars so you can see it's very king inspiredly themed and chip Altil is um or have you say that is also xed with tekken and king then we also have the legendary legacy character outfits where you have obviously lee and fox you have both him and steve and some shark outfits as well for avatars but it's good to see that lee is getting that costume i always like that one and lee's my favorite character in tekken then we also have lars and Alyssa. we have their classical outfits from tekken 5 i'm sure it was tekken 5 or tekken 6 one of those it was their outfits i'm sure it was tekken 5 though and yeah it looks cool i love how it looks it genuinely looks really good so that's most of the stuff that you are seeing there's going to be a whole load of character patches and stuff that have been released as well so you can see what nerfs and patches and stuff that are coming with the character and everything but you will be able to see this so this is definitely um really good and it's really cool that this is the character skins that we are getting really interesting stuff and really cool stuff that are definitely coming in this game in this patch and you'll be able to see all that now so just remember to reboot the game and you'll be able to see everything and anything that you need and want to to see these are all the stuff that are definitely coming 300 for those skins are unless it's changed since i last played but yes lee is officially going to get that skin and so will steve as well but i know a lot of you guys will get lars and lee skin because them two are definitely really one of the best ones but obviously let me know what do you think of this are you glad to see that we're getting these type of skins who is your favourite Tekken character that you are hoping gets a legacy skin at the end of the day when it comes round to it? And also, are you looking forward to playing as Lydia? And who is the character that you want to return? Mine's Alex. But do like, subscribe. This is your boy Future Boy heading back to future. Stay faster, peeps. Peace.